The data here represents 160 replicate measurements of blood alcohol level measured in milligrams of alcohol per 100 milliliters of blood randomly selected from a true normal distribution which has a mean value of 80 and a standard deviation of 2. We wish to compare the sample distribution to standard distributions and to do this we will analyze non-parametric tests one sample we will select the fields and the variable has already been selected we need to select the tests so we click settings we will choose the kolmogorov smirnov test and select options we see that under this test it's possible to compare the experimental distribution to any of a normal, a uniform, an exponential or a Poisson distribution. In each case it is possible to define the particular distribution that we're comparing it with so we could set the mean and standard deviation of the distribution for comparison. In this case we will just use the sample data to define the distribution that we're comparing the data with and we will just for an example test the observed distribution against normal uniform exponential and poisson distributions and click ok and then run the analysis we see the summary results of the four analyses and for the normal distribution test the analysis has identified that the sample has a mean value of 79.91 and a standard deviation of 2.07 and the test says that we should retain the null hypothesis with a p-value of 0.646. There is no evidence that the data here was derived from anything other than a normal distribution. If we now compare the sample data with a uniform distribution that is one in which we would expect to see an equal number of values in the distribution between the minimum value and the maximum value. And in this case, we should reject the null hypothesis. Between those values, the data values are not spread out uniformly. The p-value for that test is less than 0 0.0005. For the test against a Poisson distribution, it is unable to compute. This is because the Poisson distribution would expect to see just integer values and we have got non-integer values so it is unable to perform the analysis. Finally comparing the sample distribution with an exponential distribution again reject the null hypothesis the distribution is not exponential with a p-value of less than 0.0005.